Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we are talking about uh, Cortavius Ramos, Ramos versus Gaston Bolanos. Uh, Cortavius, Jesus, are you, are you not entertained? What a nickname. 9 and 2, 4 and 1 in his last five fights. Slight favorite at minus 175, 30 years old. 5 4 with a 68 inch reach. Fighting Gaston Bolanos, who's 7 and 4, 2 and 3 in his last five fights. Plus 140 underdog. 32 years old, 5'7", with a 69-inch reach, 3 inches in height with a 1-inch reach advantage for Gaston Bolanos. I just don't think Gaston Bolanos is the same guy that we've seen in kickboxing, the same guy we've seen in Bellator with these flashy knockouts. He had his issues also in Bellator with grapplers per se, but he still had very, very good flashy moments. Even in a loss, he would look good. So he hasn't really had that performance in the UFC, like... You know, he beat Aaron Phillips, who's no longer in the UFC, in not a great win. There's an argument that he did not win that fight. Then he got destroyed by Marcus McGee, which, okay, fine. Marcus McGee is kind of on the up and up, even though he's a little bit older of a of a, of a fighter, of a uh, bantamweight, I believe it is. Marcus McGee is a little bit, bit of an older one. So, again, you know... He lost to Daniel Carey by guillotine. He came back two and a half years later and beat him by TKO or KO. Again, the spinning back elbows are disgusting by Bolanos. Again, we just haven't seen that guy. We haven't seen the same uh, dream killer. So, I like Ramius. The thing that I like about him a lot is that he's pretty well-rounded. You know, seven finishes out of his nine wins. He was TKO by Ramon Tavares on the contender series. 29 seconds in. That's wild, you know? So, and he's fought decent competition so for where he was at. This is a pretty good 9-2 and two record. You know, came back on the contender series and beat uh, Michael Imper Imperato, Imperato, who was 12-6, and six, beat him by decision. Got to see a lot of different things in that matchup. And the problem for me in this one for Gaston Bolanos is he's just been kind of holding back a little bit. He's been gun-shy, six finishes, He's been finished three out of four times in his career. Five first-round finishes. Just hasn't been that dude that we were hoping to see. So, uh, Ram Ramis, Cotavius, Cotavius wins this matchup. And as always, guys, subscribe, like, comment. Let me know you're picking. Peace.